What's up everybody, Jason Moss here. Today's video, this is another Investor Carrot tutorial. This is actually how to change your theme on your Investor Carrot website, okay? Because if you're used to WordPress, it's in a little bit of a different spot, all right? Um, but I wanna show you, it's very, very easy, all right? So let's hop in here. As you can see, this is my test account. So as you can see, we're signed in and we're just on the dashboard page, okay? Nothing crazy. So when you're on a normal WordPress site, um, it's actually under like the appearance themes area, but as you can see here on the left hand side, we don't have an appearance section. Okay, so carrot kind of changes things a little bit. This is still WordPress, but they kind of change things to make it easier and make it their own. Okay, so with carrot, you're actually going to click on the design button. So it's not exactly um, hiding there at all. I mean, you want to change the theme. You know, it's probably under design, right? So you click on design and then also on WordPress, this is this is very similar. So this is like the customized menu um, in a normal WordPress website. A lot of times inside of here, um, sometimes, I mean, every theme is different in how it's built, okay? But sometimes you would change the theme inside here. But with Carrot, it's up here at the top. Very, very simple. Now, I wish it did say theme because design is kind of like not the same thing, um, but this is the theme up here. So um, as you can see, we're on the Douglas theme right now. If we click on change, you will see the different themes that are available. Now, if I had the dog on carrot, this is one thing I wish they would try to work on a little bit better or allow outside people to make themes themes uh, because we got six here all right and two of these you have to be on the premium plan um, the advanced marketer one that's the hundred and ninety nine dollar a month plan so that's the top level plan to get those two um, honestly though I got a lot of clients and I only have I think two that are on this hemlock um, theme the Hemlock theme is nice. It's it's just not for me. I don't like the um, the angled header. I just like the square. But it is, you know, a lot of people do like it. So whatever. But on this, uh, on our plan that we're on for this test site, we have these main four. Now, stock out of the box, this was the Douglas theme. Now, this is one thing that I do highly recommend changing because everybody's website comes with the Douglas theme and if you don't change it okay your website's gonna look like everybody else's all right so at least change your theme all right along with a lot of other things but at least change the theme all right the two that I really like all right you can see subtle differences here these two the Douglas and the Madrone look very similar but the main thing is like the header up here which is different all right, you can click on all these for a live preview. One that I really, really like is this uh, Juniper one. So if we click on live preview, it'll actually load our site with the theme and we can take a look at it, which is pretty neat. Um, so it's not like you have to apply it and then see if it's gonna work out. Um, once it gets loaded here, this is one I really like now I always suggest changing this. Well, I mean, not always, but um, instead of a left and right, I like a centered um, where it's in the center and make this whole block much bigger. Um, but I do, I am a fan of everything being centered because it's kind of like, kind of like a funnel in a way. Um, so I am a big fan of this one here. Um, I have a lot of clients that use the Juniper theme. Um, so very, very popular one. If you want to do it, you can just hit activate and publish and it is done. But I'm going to go to change because I was looking at this earlier. Yeah, I was cheating. And I like the cedar one. So this, as you can see, there's not a header and a menu bar. It's like a transparent one. So if we hit live preview and you can see here on the, the cedar theme, this is all transparent. So there's not a... Uh, like a just a, a square header section or a menu bar it's all just floating up there transparent now some people like that some people don't 
I'm a fan of it. I think it looks very clean. Uh, one thing we are going to do is come in here and we're going to take out a lot of this stuff, like these menu items. I really don't know why they have all these different menu items. I like to clean that up, only leave the phone number. When you come to my website, I mean, this is all about lead generation, yo. All I want you to do is either fill this out or I want you to call our company, you know. I don't want you to have all these other options. Um, I mean, obviously, some navigational options are important, but I like to clean it up a lot. I even get rid of this uh, little subline as well, which we'll show you that in other videos. But yeah, this is the cedar theme. I really, really like this one. Um, and like I said, once you pick a theme and you're ready to rock and roll, all right, just come over here to activate and publish, hit that and bing bada boom it's done um, it is published that's your live website now uh, we can hit this X here and you can see it's live alright now I might switch this up change the design a little bit of course we're gonna change colors change this background picture guys that's a very important thing this type of house okay this is St. Charles County house buyers um, that is Missouri we do not have houses like that okay so that's one thing to think about don't leave the stock picture that they give you all right even if this kind of house exists where you're buying houses just change it okay it's easy just change it all right but especially I mean there, there's no house in st. Charles County that looks like this you know this looks like like stucco uh, walls and then I forget what that roof is called uh, but we don't have that at all so change that um, change your theme up, you know, tweak your website, always, always, always tweak your website, but uh, go through this playlist because I'm going to put these videos in a playlist for all the investor care um, videos that I have, you know, and if you got a question, leave it below. I'm happy to help. If this video is helpful, please, please, please smash that like button. It really helps the YouTube al algorithm get this video out to more people, helps me, helps, helps this channel. Um, allows me to keep bringing you these kind of videos. Um, if you do not have a carrot website, link in the description below. Let me know after you get it purchased and I'll give you uh, our bonuses that we have for you. So those are very, very cool. Uh, just shoot me an email or something. Um, but yeah, if you got questions, leave them below. Happy to help. I will see you guys in the next video.